Hey there, I'm Dr. Charlie. Picture this, the year was 2009. I had just left my full-time job. I was thrilled. I had started a business. I'll tell you about that in a moment. And I was doing all the things, all the business, the online business things of the day. I was posting content. I wrote, it must have been like 200 articles over the course of a couple of years. And I had ebooks and I had e courses and I was doing all the things. I would take a meander downtown and drop my business cards off and do all of those businessy things. I had taken a boot camp, a business boot camp for women with a woman who was way ahead of her time. Um, and just, I was following it sort of, I was still largely kind of doing my own thing. And that first time I left my full-time job, I was woefully unprepared to actually make a living without a full-time income. I finally learned, and it took me quite a bit of time to actually learn this, but I finally learned that a little bit here and a little bit over there, that those little pieces added up and I could figure out how to add them all together at first to make my expenses work. And eventually I got to a point where I even uncomplicated that process. And now one stream of income pays for housing. Another stream of income is my day-to-day -day expenses. A third stream of income helps me pay down debt. You get the picture. Really, my point is that I kept going. I kept doing the things that worked. I finally stopped doing the things that didn't work. Quick story about my business. It took me, it was failing. I understood what I needed to shift and never actually shifted. It took me three years to say out loud that my first business failed. However, the lesson didn't fail. I did learn about the little things here and the little things there. I also learned to stop doing the things that aren't working and I am much better able now to shift and pivot and move with what needs moving. I am excellent at being done and leaving a thing. So I say all of that to just give you a word. Whatever it is that makes your heart sing, keep going. If you need to rest and pivot for a moment to get yourself back on track, that's okay. Do that. And when you're ready, when you're as rested as you're going to be, get back up, look at the plan that you have, see what's working, and do more of that, and stop doing what isn't working. Let me know if this resonates with you in the comments. Take great care. Oh, and why was business in quotation marks? I made exactly one sale. Sale is also in quotation marks. And really it was $10. And I had to ask a friend to purchase a $10 thing for me so that I could see that my shopping cart worked for someone else. I had a shopping cart though.